my benefit and moved here early enough I could still do everything. And now the time has come. I'm in my 90s and everything's slower and slower, but I get around and make do. But like I say, some wait until too late to come in to really enjoy it and to enjoy the people to visit with. We make many good friends here and their families. Some of the first ones that I knew, you meet them by accident here, get to know them real well. And the first thing you know, you get to know their families and they accepted us all. You know, you, you've got to make your place in a community when you go. And like I say, the first place was the church. You get to know the people and, and everything and be involved. It just seems like a family. We've all become so acquainted and know each other and their families. Yeah, it's just like a big family. We have a hymn sing every night. We have volunteers come in and lead the hymn sing. But then they have other activities going on through the week. The activities departments, we have something to do nearly every day. And besides having our own free time, but nearly every day there's something special that we can go to. And I've had my family Christmas Eve party here different times. Yeah, because that was always our tradition to celebrate on Christmas Eve. So the family would come in and bring things. I can't brag enough about it though, Bill. It's been a way for me. And I think it would be most anybody. I feel safe here. I feel comfortable here. And they have a good reputation. I was looking for a Christian environment to live in because I've been a Christian most of my life. And I knew that they had devotions here. I knew we prayed before meals here because I had an aunt that lived here. And so I kind of knew before I came. And that's why I chose this one. I could have stayed in Valparaiso. My family's up there, but I chose this one because it met my needs. My kids like the fact that I live here. They're really happy about it. They don't have to look after me. They know I'm well taken care of. They visit me. We talk on the phone but they do not have to worry about me. It's a big relief for them because they see some of their friends' parents that they have to run and take care of their parents. And, you know, I did not want that. I've had my turn. It's their turn. They have kids, they have grandkids of their own. If somebody was thinking about coming, I'd ask them to come, especially with someone I really know. Come spend a day with me, see what our days are like, and see that it isn't what you think it is. We have a big calendar that shows all the activities that are going on, there's something every day. And if you'll come here in the evening, you'll see little groups just sitting and visiting after supper. And that to me is community. It used to be you'd think of institutions. This is not an institution. This is a home. I don't consider this my room. This is my home.